Hello students, in this video, let us try to find out the solution for the question as on your screen. Which of the halogens is strongest oxidizing agent in water? Is it F2, Cl2, Br2 or I2? To find out the correct option of this, let us move ahead. Now there are two ways to get the solution of this particular question. The first way is by knowing the reduction potential values which you can easily get with the help of electrochemical series. So the, uh, the particular electro reduction potential values are being specified on the right hand side of the screen. So for F2 it is plus 2.65 volt in case of Cl2 plus 1.359 volt. BR2 plus 1.087 volt and for I2 it is plus 0.535 volt. So as we can observe as we move down across the series you can observe the positive reduction potential value is going on decreasing right. So one tip here you have to remember it and you are in a position to solve any such type of question. The more positive the electrode potential value more easily it is reduced that means stronger is the oxidizing agent so on that basis what you can say f2 it has more positive reduction potential value compared to others so it can be easily reduced that means it can undergo easy reduction okay and so f2 now will be a stronger oxidizing agent right the other way out the other possibility how you are going to work out if you if if you do not know the reduction potential values for that right then how can you work out if you consider f2 f2 is fluorine is an electronegative element it's a strong electronegative element compared to cl2 bromine and iodine right so it will have a strong tendency to accept electron pairs towards itself Okay, so it will easily accept the electron pairs towards itself. That means it can easily undergo reduction. And since it can easily undergo reduction, it is a strong oxidizing agent. Is it clear? Right? So this is one of the important questions which come in your common entrance test. Be prepared for this. So work hard, stay safe. Thank you for watching.